During digestion, lipids are hydrolyzed to fatty acids and glycerol. Fatty acids and glycerol can be oxidized to generate ATP or used to produce triglycerides for energy storage. Lipid catabolism begins with lipolysis, the process that breaks down lipids into fatty acids and glycerol. Lipids must be broken down before they can be oxidized to generate ATP in the Krebs cycle. Lipolysis is stimulated by hormones such as epinephrine, norepinephrine, and cortisol, as well as thyroid and human growth hormones. After lipolysis, fatty acids and glycerol are oxidized in different ways. Fatty acids undergo beta-oxidation, a series of reactions that form acetyl coenzyme A from a two-carbon fragment of a fatty acid chain and coenzyme A. The acetyl coenzyme A then enters the Krebs cycle, which produces reduced coenzymes that are used to generate ATP in the electron transport chain.